Good morning, you guys. It is Tuesday and it's about 10.30. I'm running to the store really quick to just get a couple things. Um, it's a really hot day today. So I figured I'm gonna do what with the boys, um, some like summer treats. So that's what we're gonna do today. That's what the video is gonna be today. Some kids summer treats. Um, I think they're gonna have a lot of fun with it. It involves chocolate, so I already know that they're gonna enjoy it. It's gonna be fun to make. As I started recording, I think it's a little blurry or it might look a little weird. Um, I shattered my phone screen yesterday. So I think it's like shattered over the camera part on this side. So if it looks weird, that is why but I think that it will be okay to do the screen because I know if it's like too damaging you can't do the screen but I think it should be fine so hopefully I'll get to that maybe this week um, because it's hard to use and I don't want to cut my fingers but yeah I'm just going to finish getting to the store here now and I'll see you guys in a little bit so the first snack that I did was yogurt bark and there's so many different ways that you can do it. But we did the simple way and I just used vanilla Greek yogurt. I use Greek yogurt just cause it's thicker and it freezes better. And we just did strawberries. with your kids because it's super simple the boys did it pretty much all by themselves with my help but Maddox spread out the yogurt onto the pan and then the boys sprinkled the cut up strawberries wherever they wanted and then we just put it right in the freezer <laughs> took was about two hours for the yogurt to harden enough and then it comes right off of the parchment paper it's super easy I just crumbled it into pieces for the boys and I put it into a Tupperware and you can put it right in the freezer from there Did, which was probably my favorite is the pineapple boat mm. this one is another super easy one the hardest part is cutting the pineapple in the middle as you can tell this is my first time doing this just going to cut out the insides of each of the sides of the pineapple. This does not have to be nice or look pretty because you're just going to fill it with fruit.
Next, I'm gonna make the chocolate sauce and all you're gonna need for that is semi-sweet chocolate chips, heavy whipping cream, and I use sour cream just to take the bitterness out of the chocolate a little bit. All I did was heat up about four ounces of the heavy whipping cream and I poured that over the chocolate chips just so it was hot enough to melt them and it gets thicker as you can tell and I did a dollop of the sour cream. The last snack that we did was chocolate covered bananas. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is cut the bananas in half and stick popsicle sticks in them. All I did was put them in the freezer for about two hours. When the bananas were pretty much done in the freezer, I started doing the chocolate sauce and all I did for that was use a cup of the semi-sweet chocolate chips and just a spoonful of the coconut oil. So I had here warm water, not boiling because your chocolate will start hardening up on you and getting clumpy. So just warm enough to melt it. And then you can do the bananas right over the stove top. Is it good? Yes. Is it good, Grayson? 